This video is proudly sponsored by Cameron Hoskin TV, the official YouTube channel for up and coming UK singer and songwriter Cameron Hoskin. He really is at the forefront of British rising talent, so why not check him out before he's number one on all the charts? Be sure to head over to his channel because he's got a variety of music videos and covers planned for the coming months, and he'd really appreciate your support, so make sure to subscribe while you're there. Talking of support, this brand new single, You Don't Know, is now available to purchase on iTunes, so check the description for download links and more. Thank you for supporting the likes of Cameron, who are supporting me by sponsoring my videos. For links to any of the sites mentioned in this message, check the description below. Thank you. Hi, I'm Brittany Louise Taylor, and I watch Ask the Teen on Teen Talks. <laughs> Enjoy! Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Ask the Teen. This is Ask the Teen episode number 74 and today I've got loads of stuff to get through but first of all well done to everyone that so far has entered for the Salmon Fishing in the Yemen, that's the book, yep, uh, for that competition. Uh, we've had quite a few entries, all you have to do is go to my agent video, that's my Base Chase 2 video, uh, we took so much time doing that, I really hope you like that. It's a new short film that I've made, look in the description for a link, all you have to do is go over there, go in the description, leave a nice comment or whatever comment you like, you can say you don't like it if you like but then just put a one at the end and that's how I know you want to win Salmon Fishing in the Yemen by Paul Torday. So make sure to go over there and on with the questions. Mr. Ben 175 gives me a really hard scenario here because he says you could either have as a pet a black widow or a python. You can't choose neither. Which one do you have? Well, if I can't choose neither, I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, both? I don't know why. Another weird question for you next, everyone. This is MK and MH and they ask me, if you had a pet alien, what would you name it? Well, I would probably actually have to name it Paul because after the film itself and nailing called Paul would be pretty cool and you could just be like, oh, hey, Paul, you would turn around and you'd be like, E.T. Because E.T.'s real name's Paul, everyone knows that, right? Ginger JD and Scabby asks me, if you had one thing to change in your life, what would you change and why? Well, I don't know what I would change, actually. I should probably think of the answers before I come to the questions. But if I had to change one thing, it would be that nothing changes. And I know that's kind of a bit complicated but if I could change anything it would be to make sure that nothing's going to change in the future because I like it just the way it is and I don't want anything to change so let's just stay the way it is. Everyone that thinks life is awesome just like down there because you only live once right? Now you may remember a few episodes ago Little Miss Commenter asked me which accents I could do, I told her and now she's back asking to hear those accents. So I do warn you they're not that good and I'm not trying to offend anyone uh, but I will give it a go. So I probably said Australian, I can't even remember what I said. But if I said Australian it's going to go a bit like this. So good day, mate, how is everybody today? It's an alligator over there. And now it's time for the news to talk to me and I talk it through to you in the news talks everyone. So in case you're unfamiliar with the show I have some topics for you today, I've got two. And I'll just talk to you and then you can respond down below and let me know some ideas for the next episode. So today, as I said, two topics. First one, Katy Perry is performing her new single or newish single, Part of Me, on American Idol tonight, the 26th of April. So if you haven't heard the song yet, make sure to watch it. Wherever you've been, under a rock, I don't know, but tonight is your chance to listen to it again. Katy Perry's amazing, as you know, she's my favourite singer, so make sure to watch it if you haven't seen her already. Now also, as I mentioned last week, and it did really well, thank you to everyone that viewed last week's episode, uh, Cheryl Cole's new single, Call My Name, the video is coming out on Wednesday the 4th of May. So uh, if you haven't heard the song yet, make sure to go and check it out. It's actually really interesting. It's kind of a new direction for her, but make sure to check it out and let us know what you think in the comments below. Thank you, and now it's time for the Teens Top 10. And now it's time for the Teens Top 10, everyone. If you're not familiar with this section of the show, it's where we find out which order your favourite artists are in this week. So if you'd like to make sure your favourite hits the top spot next week, you can do. In the description below my sponsored information, you will find a link to voting. Go over there and vote, and make sure you vote loads of times to make sure your favourite hits the top spot. This week at number 10, I've got a few Kesha. She's back in the chart again. Gautier are also back in the chart at number 9. One Direction have slipped a few, it's number 8 for them, not number 1. Then Madonna is at number 7, she's back in the chart again, I wonder why. Number 6, Lady Gaga, she's taken a climb again, I mean she's been down for a few weeks, but maybe this is a good sign for her. Katy Perry hits number 5, this is the lowest she's ever been in the chart, what's going on with her? Maybe her performance tonight on American Idol will kickstart that back rise up the chart. Then number 4, he's down 3 places, it's Marcus Collins, last week's number 1. 
Then number three, it's a new high for her, it's Lana Del Rey. Number two, it's a new entry for YouTube sensation Cameron Hoskin TV. And number one, that means we've got an all new new poster. Thanks to Nerd Jam and his Tim Minchin stand crew, you can find Tim Minchin at number one. Make sure your favourites here next week. I've told you how. Now onto the next section. We're nearly at the end of our satine, everyone. Oh my goodness, what are you going to do for another week? Uh, well, you could go and check out some of the early ones. But before I go, you have got time for a shout out. Down there is F11 Bar 884. That's the channel for Sarah. Now, she's a great young lady with a lovely, beautiful singing voice uh, that she kind of gives to us every few weeks on YouTube. Does lots of amazing covers. And sadly, she's got cancer. And I mean, she's got a 2% survival rate. And hopefully, she's in that 2%. So, fingers crossed, she is because she's such a lovely young lady. Corporal and Mackie invited me to her channel and showed her to me and I'm so glad he did I've subscribed and she's got such a bubbly and positive personality and if no one else deserves your subscribe this week she does so make sure to go and check her out thank you for watching another episode of Ask Teen. if you'd like to follow any of my links you've got my Facebook Teen Talks Twitter, Greg Frog, and of course YouTube, that's the Teen 2, that's my second channel. Make sure to go and check them out. Got a question for next week? Leave it below. Want a shout out next week? Leave it below. And then I will see you next week. Thank you and please subscribe. Bye for now everyone.